Hi, welcome back. Today I have another grocery haul and meal plan for you. Please excuse my voice, I have a bit of a chesty cold so I don't quite sound quite myself today. Um, no COVID-19 symptoms though, so not to worry about that. Right, this is my shop for this week. We have a shop from Asda this week. Um, someone had asked me if I am still shopping at Aldi because they noticed I haven't been posting any Aldi hauls for a while. Um, we haven't been as much just because um, I like to do the click and collect so I'll order my shopping online and then I'll go and pick it up and I just feel like it's a little bit safer that way um, I don't need to take the kids in the shop if I've got them with me they can we're all in the car and it just gets popped in the book for us um, so it just feels a little bit safer and obviously you can't do that at Aldi so I have been going to like Asda or Tesco more so than Aldi recently we have been in a couple of times but we've generally been using Asda and Tesco more so that answers that question. So today it's an Asda shop. I'm going to show you all the things I bought. As always, I will tell you how much I spent um, on my shopping. And then if you stay tuned to the end, I will share my meal plan for this week. Again, apologies for my voice. It's slowly going. <laughs> but thank you so much for watching today. If you're not already subscribed, it would be great if you would subscribe and hit the bell notification so that you get notifications of my videos. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. It helps tell YouTube that this is a video worth sharing. So let's get straight in and I'll show you what I bought. Okay, let's start here. So I got two bags of carrots for meals this week. I got a head of broccoli and some cauliflower. I got two loaves of bread, the no crust one, the King's Mill no crust, because I always end up cutting off the crust for the girls anyway, so I might as well just cut this one and save myself a job. So I got a whole meal and a white one because my niece and nephew are coming and I know they only like white bread. We normally get whole meal, so I got one of each. Um, I got two bags of the, what is it, extra special British baby potatoes for meals this week. Um, I got extra crisps this week because Caitlin's having a birthday sleepover and I wanted to get some nice snacks for her so I got some popcorn, I got some pickled onion monster munch, some McCoys and some Watsits and I think these three were on offer at Asda, it was like three for whatever so I got those, I got popcorn because I know that she specifically likes popcorn um, I got some strawberries, some grapes, some apples and two bags of bananas for fruit um, I got some korma, a jar of korma sauce um, for a meal this week. I normally make my own korma sauce, but I just thought for quick and easiness, I would just get a jar this week for a change. Um, mm -hmm. I got a jar of chocolate spread. The girls love that. And I got some Heinz tomato soup. Caitlin really likes Heinz tomato soup. And um, she's quite a picky eater, so if there's ever anything that we're having for dinner that she doesn't like, she'll just often have some tomato soup in a sandwich or something instead. Um, what else? Oh yeah, I got this um, frozen diced beef. I can't tell you if this is any good or not because I've never had it before, but I will let you know next time if it was any good. Um, and I've got this to make a beef stew this week in the slow cooker, so I'm hoping that that's going to be good. Um, I also got a packet of a thousand grams, so a kilogram of um, mince, beef mince, and it's the less than 5% fat one, again for a meal this week. Um, I got some bacon, I actually got three packets of the thick cut unsmoked bacon. We have family coming to stay this weekend and I picked that up so we can do bacon rolls in the morning. Um, I got two of the great big packets of the chicken breast fillets. These are a kilogram each for meals this week. So I got two of those. And to go with those I got some lemons and I got a head of garlic and I don't normally buy garlic like this I would normally just buy um I normally use pureed garlic but I think I'm, the recipe is going to call for the a head of garlic so um we'll give that a try and I also got a cucumber okay the rest of the items I got I got eight of the Warburton's soft white rolls these are the ones I normally get um because they're just so handy they're already pre-cut and Kids like them and they're a good size. So I got those for a meal this week. We're going to do homemade burgers. So I got those. I got some pan au chocolats for breakfast. Um, when Caitlin has her sleepover with her friend. Um, I got some mini rolls as a treat. Um, I got this chesty cough mixture for myself. Because as you might be able to hear. Um, I've got a bit of a chesty cold at the moment. Um, I picked up these because they're just handy to have as a backup. If I don't have anything made for autumn. So these are the Little Angels Organic Meals. 
and I got the vegetable and beef hot pot and the sweet potato and cottage pie. Um, that one says 10 months plus. I just noticed this one says 12 months plus. Um, she is almost 12 months, but not quite. But this one is from 10 months. Um, I got some sweet clementines to have in our fruit bowl. I got a block of the mature white cheddar cheese, just to add a smart price one. Um, some more treats for the weekend for the sleepovers and for when we have family staying. So we got two packets of the munchies. I think they were only a pound each, which I thought was quite good. I got these Terry's chocolate orange minis because I know Caitlin loves them. And like I say, it's her birthday sleepover. Um, she's have, I've also got two packets of the Maltesers. Um, I got two packets of the wildlife variety tubes. These are just like um, frubes, but they're Yoplait ones. Um, and they were on offer, so I got two packets. I got a bottle of red wine because um, my brother-in-law likes red wine, so he can have that when they come over. Um, this is for Andrew. He likes the brew dog um, ales, so he's got this one this time. Um, we got some Pringles for snacks. Um, I got a big four-litre thing of milk. I would normally get two of these, but I know I've already got one in the fridge. Um, I've got a bottle of Lilt as a treat. Um, my sister is pregnant, so she can't drink alcohol. So while the boys are having their treats, we'll have some Lilt, um, which is our favorite since childhood. Um, and I also got some orange squash for the kids, orange and pineapple. I got a pack of Cheerios. I normally just get their own brand ones, but um, I couldn't get, find them online for Asda. So I just got the actual Cheerios. Um, I also got a packet of their wheat bisques, which are like wheat bix but just their own brand. And I didn't mean to get such a big box. It's like a massive box of 48 of them. So I might just like take out one of the tubes, dot tubes, you know what I mean? One of the packets inside and put it in something and then put the rest in the cupboard to store it away for just now, like in our storage cupboard in the hall. I'll see, we'll work that one out. But that is everything that I got today. I'm gonna to pop the price up on the screen as always of how much I spent today. And if you stay watching, you will see my meal plan for this week. Okay, so we are going to do my meal plan for this week. I have it in my head at the moment, so we're going to get it down on paper. So this week, rather than um, allocating a day for each meal, I've decided I'm just going to write a list of the meals and then I can decide what days I'm going to have them. So first meal we are going to have, we've got the chicken, so we're going to have the um, lemon chicken with the lemons I bought and the garlic. Um, so we're going to have lemon chicken and veg, we've got those new potatoes and we've got broccoli and cauliflower and things. Um, as well with the chicken we are going to have that um, curry with the korma sauce that I bought. So we will have korma and I know I have naan breads in the freezer. Um, so I've got korma one night. I should have put chicken korma. <laughs> I know what I mean. Chicken korma and we've, I've got rice in the cupboard so chicken korma with rice and naan. I'll just add that. Um, what else? So that's two chicken dishes and um, we have the mince. I was going to do homemade burgers that was my plan but I'm filming this on Monday and we actually used the buns to make bacon rolls on Sunday so we don't have any buns so I'm gonna to have to make up something else with the mince so I think what I might do is just traditional Scottish mince and tatties um, because we've got two bags of the potatoes so we'll have mince and tatties um, and we'll have carrots and peas I've got peas in the freezer so that's three meals a fourth meal uh, what else did I get? Oh yes, I got the frozen beef, didn't I? So that I could do the beef stew. So I will do slow cooker beef stew. And is that how you stew? I think it is. And I've actually got um, some puff pastry in the fridge that I bought a couple of weeks ago for something else and I haven't used. So I might make up some like little pastry parcels so that it's almost like a... Um, a bit like a steak pie with the beef and the pastry but I'm not going to cook it as a pie I'm just going to cook the pastry separate so um slow cooker beef stew with veg and I'm going to put and pastry so that's one two three four meals and um, five we will probably just have some pasta dish because I know we've got some dried pasta so I'll put pasta and then 
I think I'm only going to plan for five days at the moment because there's a good chance we might have some leftovers um, from definitely these three and there's a chance we might eat out one of the nights either at family or um, we might end up getting a takeaway or something so I'm just going to plan for those five nights so that's my meal plan for five of the nights as I say I'm not going to allocate them up a specific day because I'm just going to cook them as and when I decide but that is my meal plan for this week with the food that I bought thank you so much for watching today I hope you enjoyed this video if you did it would be great if you'd give it a thumbs up if you're not subscribed and you enjoyed this video it would be great if you'd subscribe so that you get notifications when I upload more videos I do lots of videos like this grocery hauls meal plans um, home type videos so if you enjoy this kind of thing think about subscribing that would be great and thank you so much for watching I'll see you next time take care bye